Sniffy Iffy, where are you? Good job, friends. Everyone make it across safely. Now, it is, now it's time to start selling stuff to Ardenian militia. <laughs> uh oh, it's not good. What? Sniffy Iffy smells seems sent as products we brought coming from all, all around. Our products that we bring already supplied to standard by military. We not sell anything at this rate. If you know, must get new product line up here in Temperentia. Collect things that seem useful from around here and make into product. Friends very kind. Sniffy Happy may start crying. Okay, please find Sniffy Happy any useful material from Temperentia. Just need enough materials to be able to start a business. Sniffy Happy will be waiting then. Uh, yeah, we gotta collect items. Wonderful. But before we do that, let's go. What now, then? Before we do that, I want to be here. Uh, I want to place Tora because there's a certain thing that we can do right around here. Be able to break the game. Might take some trying. Jelly. Oh, yeah, it's very difficult to get up up here. Yes, indeed, it is. Oh, boy. Break your game. I will get into places I'm not supposed to. You cannot stop me. Oh, there we go. All right. So here we are in the out of bounds, uh, a place we're not supposed to be in. Uh, let me switch back to Rex Man. Here we are in a place we're not supposed to be, and as you can see, we are uh, outside of the map. Yes, very lovely, isn't it? Um, obviously, we're going to see some uh, really weird textures. But uh, we can also kind of see just how big Temperanchi is, and the fact that the entire sort of... Well, that the fact that the play area that you get in the game is actually very small in comparison to the rest of the model. So I believe this whole model is rendered out despite the fact that the space you get to actually use is so small. This place is just uh, an empty void with nothing inside, probably because you're not supposed to actually come over here. Of course, we also get to see the uh, weird textures that we're not supposed to see as well. I 
I don't know if there's any death plans or anything over here. Or anything that's supposed to kill you. Or if the ground just suddenly drops out and you fall into the pit of death. But, I mean, it's interesting to be here, I guess. Because you can actually explore pretty much the entirety of Temperantia. If you can't get out of bounds. Uh, and I don't think the game will actually let you swim around. I believe it does cut you off at some point. Oh yes, we can see this. This is lovely. Oh boy, I can see under the map where I'm not supposed to be seeing. Wow, look at that. Look at this rock that just suddenly cuts off. Oh, this looks weird. Does this rock have collision? Oh, it, it has one-way collision, all right. I expect a few things to not have any collision out here. <laughs> This rock has collision. There's like a cliff over here. Ooh, -hoo, my salmon! I need to get more jelly. Uh, it feels very uh, dead and empty. And also, it looks kind of glitchy. Today, we break the game, yes. And that looks really weird. Pretty weird. But of course this is not a place you're supposed to see. Not a place you're supposed to see, that's for sure. That's very for sure. Oh, I can get up over here. If I can go this, this far, that is. I am no longer on the map. Great. Uh, and my zoom dot map is empty. It's a new day, everyone. Look alive. Why do I need to look alive? There's nothing around except for rocks. Rocks and uh, glitchy textures. All right, now if there's anything that was actually gonna kill me, it'd probably be this part right here. I expect. Right, that looks kind of weird. Will you kill me, game? The answer seems to be no. Well, then I guess I'll just keep on walking, then. Keep on walking through this, uh... Empty expanse. See how far I can get. I believe we're on... This sort of fin now. Makes me wonder what they would have put here if Temperantia was a lot bigger. I don't know, I feel like something cool could have gone here. Instead of just the small, tiny area that you get. I don't know, Temperantia's kind of weird because it feels like... It feels kind of like um, Prison Island from the first game where it's pretty much just here for story and that's it. I mean, there's like, 
unique monsters. There's a few quests that occur here, so I guess it's not exactly like Prison Island, but it's pretty close. There ain't much here. However, I see something over there. What is that? Yes, yes. I say we go take a look. Although I don't know if I can get onto that because it looks like it's all sloped. And also this water, which I feel like it might kill me. Actually, what's over here? It's just a little alcove. A little alcove. Right, just a little alcove. Now to make the swim. Uh, so I can get up over there, actually. Man, I sure do hope the game doesn't kill me. That would be unfortunate. I guess nothing just lives out here. Oh, man. More cut-off textures. Oh, boy. I don't even know what this part would be. I can't really see below us. What? Uh, I fell through the ground. Oh, and I died. <laughs> or I fell through the ocean. I ex kind of expected that to happen. I just had a frightful dream. Huh. Well. <sighs> Careful next time. Well, I got I got leaping shoe for Tela, so I guess it's uh, all good. Frame output increasing. Such folly. You can leap from great heights, but you will never soar. Well, I guess that, that wasn't an entirely fruitless endeavor, but... I mean, it was interesting to see nothing. Anyways, let's actually go do the quest. What have we here? What have we here? Yeah. So I just got to talk to Sniffy, 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 Sniffy. Come out, come out. Flora heals an aching soul. Please open your hearts to me. Bring all the stuff. We're gonna get three explosions. Wow! Look at all these yum, delicious items. Including a death mushroom. Oh boy. We well, heard about that. Come out, come out. I know quite a bit. Do you? Fire Tarantula. Fire Tarantula. What have we here? I know quite a bit. Well, I hope there's actually going to be rocks this time. Two rocks. Oh, boy. Walnut grape. Oh, boy. Those things are back. Lovely. What have we here? Oh, hello. Birds. It must have sensed our skill. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Okay, I got wrecked. It's fine. We'll get them yet. Because I tried to run away. Try to do it properly this time. Probably because I tried to run. We'll bring in the tank. What have we here? What have we here? Oh, insanity moss. Oh, 
Oh boy. Come out, come out. Here, fishy, fishy. They're looking for fish here. I don't know what kind of fish we're gonna live in a poison wasteland, but. This time, I'm ready Let's for you. Thing Make sure you got my tail racks. Well New done. Enemy in the mix. Come here. I no longer live Focus in the single top. Yeah. Anchor shot. Ha! Did it. Sure. Yeah. Come on. Uh, so, uh, we can do it. Anchor, anchor. Sure. Good. For sure. Anchor shot. Anchor shot. Anchor shot. Anchor shot. Thanks for the support. Let's get the shot. Why not? Break. Let me try it. Let me try it. Let me try it. Let me try it. Let me Gotcha. I have the aggro once again. Great. Oh, I died again. Focusing on this guy back. I apologize. Hold your horses. Yeah. Cut down. She's Thanks getting tough. I'm running away. Thanks, Buffy. See you later. Come out, oh, come jellies. out. Jellies. A lot of jellies. So we got guard check. Nice. That's not guard check. Poppy's battle sense increased. Time for lots of upgrades. Uh, I'm gonna go make a jelly. Jelly stop. I'm gonna go pick up my jellies. I need my jellies. <sighs> Let's rest the spell. Alchemy. Let's get going. Adept. You, Mr. Man, you have my jellies. Give me the jellies. Feed my addiction to jellies. Now who's ran out of jelly? You have. Here's jelly. Mithra likes sweets. You need jelly too. Crossout also likes sweets. Uh What's up with this Redeeming Bear Carving? I know it's important. Uh, at least I think it is anyways. Redeeming Bear Carving. Ah, oh, I see. Where do I get this mask from, actually? Uh, this is an item from Fawnset. All right. Thanks. I let it. Oh man, a whole bunch of us like art. Nia. Here, you have this. The tails on Adenian base sculptures are just the cutest. Uh, whatever you say. Uh, now I need to go back to Hunset. You will get more of the masks. That's Temperantia. Fawnset. 
I don't actually know where it is, but it's somewhere. That was a slog. Oh, it's right Let over here, go. actually. Oh, and I actually own the star, too. Ah, boss, many thanks for dropping by. World tree, oh, that's spoilers. Ooh, that beta skull. Hmm. Uh, I guess this. Beta scope's very good. It doesn't behoove me to do the work. That's your job. Enough slacking. I require more. Yeah, whatever. Whatever you say. Ah, oh, yes. That quest. I know of this quest, but right now we're doing another quest. We're doing a different quest. Not there. Uh, over here at the Adair Garrison. Go oh, I handed some items. Let's rest the spell. Let's get going. What's up? Friends bring items? Yes, here, have this. And uh, this, and this. And this, and this, and this, and this, and this, and this. Poison flash, poison flash, poison flash. Fish, fish. There you go. This should be enough for setting up good lineup to open shop with. Thanks, thanks, friends, much. Except there's one more problem. Maybe friends can help. Current lineup of product enough to for decent opening. Probably able to make a bit of money, but lineup still lacking in impact. Need key item that will catch eye of customer. So, sniff if you think, we should try to get hands on Metal Brooch. It's apparently a very popular item with soldiers around here. How come? Sniffy, have you never heard of Metal Brooch before? So, I'm not sure why valuable. Sniffy, have you tried asking soldiers for details, but they're not telling. Say he is too much dangerous for not one to collect. Thanks, friends, for help. Ten Metal Brooch should be enough. Soldiers can't stop talking about them. Can't stop talking about them, huh? You. Tell me. Hmm? What are you after? Alright, no, Brute just told that no point about. Yeah, those tend to get washed up with the show on air. That, the one with the, with the view of Triage Isle. The cool thing about them is you can use them as the ultimate piece in the Dueling Kingdoms board game. It's a local rule around here, not some official. As anyone can see, there isn't much civilization here in Tebrantia, so we're starved for things to do. Board games we brought with us are one of the few forms of entertainment we have. But we'd get bored just playing them over and over, so we started adding new rules to keep things interesting. Anyway, if those nop one do start selling metal breaches, I reckon they'll sell like nobody's business. But there are nasty monsters on that coast where they wash up, so I told them nop one let's go look for them. Be alright, shame all around if they just came all the way out here just to become monster chow. You seem to be able to take care of yourselves, so by all means, head down to that coast and have a look around. Well, I think I will do exactly that, mister. Uh, but I guess I'll have to hoof it. But uh, as he did say, it is kind of dangerous. Because of these uh, Lexos that hang out. There's a whole bunch of these breaches around. And of course, a whole bunch of dangers to go with them. One. Two. Three. Uh, we'll go 
for this one next. We'll have to jump off though. Four. Why, hello there. Oh, double hello there. Man, I wish I could see. Oh, jeez, you're a toughie. Ouch. Lose interest quickly, please. Thank you, you're so kind. You are not kind, though. I wish you would go away. So this is, uh, nine! And 10. And I'm gonna run away before that guy even thinks about taking his, a chomp out of me. And where you? Let us go. Hey, yo, I got you the goods. Is that smell of rare treasure sniffy if you can only sell here? Ah, metal brooches sniffy if you still not sure why these are valuable. Soldiers have demand for them. Is job of no punch to provide supply. Now, if if you have a perfect lineup for an initial shop opening. By the way, we're friends. We're friends. Find those brooches. That coast just nearby. Thanks for info. No need to worry. Sniffy if you collect treasure using most covert sneaking techniques. Monsters, monsters never know. Thanks, friends, for all of helping. Please take this as thanks. And we get our reward. A whole bunch of things. Oh boy. Stiff if he becomes the doc doc trading. Look, look, much stuff, many things to go pick. It's all worth it. Yes, momentary brilliance. Um, I believe a good chunk of his stuff actually sell for quite a big chunk of cash. Uh, but of course, it's probably because it's so dangerous here. Uh, anyways, back to the Praetorium. To go and uh, do the thing. The quest. Meh. Meh. Long journeys make Tora tired. What will we find? And of course, this as well. I need my thing up. Burying her soul because I don't remember. Oh wow. I'm learning something new. Oh man, you're almost done. Hey! No need to thank me. Hmm, just one time isn't telling you much. I think we're going to need more the other volumes. Oh man. It's strange. Knowledge is a gift that keeps on giving. Extraordinary. I'm more powerful than before. Just can't wait to experiment with it. This is something I already read. Uh, I need to increase your trust. Oh wow! <laughs> yes! 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 I feel I can go. Just you wait. Uh, how many stamps do I have? Four. That's not enough. I need nine. Or do I? I don't remember. Is it level three or level four that I needed? Level four, so I do need more stamps. 
Our Jacob. Sparkly costumes, what's this for? I don't know what this is for. But I guess I'll do it because I think I need to anyway. Everyone's counting on me! I gotta step it up! I yes, think sir. I'll have to anyways. What's your plan, boss? What's your what's your plan, boss? I'll finish the job properly. I won't let you down. I'll finish the job properly. Go for it. Uh, Gormot, what's your deal? Gormot, secret area. Oh boy. We need a strength 20, it seems. Hmm. I withdraw reluctantly. I'll lend you my strength. <laughs> I'll support you in I every way. I will strive to do the oh, utmost go, best. Go, Never my role. sort of bad rep, don't they? Yes. Uh, we will use Tingling Troop. Yes. I hereby call you the Tingling Troop. Free dumplings all around. No more than 300 gold on snacks, okay? Just show me the way. 300 gold, that's not a whole lot. Let's open a blade. Zeke! Do your thing, Zeke. Give me something good. Give me something good, give me something nice, give me something tasty, 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 tasty. Oh, I think I know who this is. It's this man. Look at him. My name is Godfrey. What's up, Godfrey? Whoa! The hammer of justice packs a mean punch. Is that so? Meet Godfrey, the ice shield hammer. He has a max HP modification of 15%. He has tough break, cold judgment, justice, blizzard, and whiteout as his specials. He has arts, arts plus, and draw aggro as his blade arts. His battle skills are got the guts, reduce damage taken by 24% when HP is 30% or lower, and fierce fervor increases damage dealt to higher level enemies by 20%. He also has passionate soul, justice loving soul, and kind soul as his field skills, which are all exclusive to Godfrey and literally only used in side quests. Uh, and I think he only has one ox course a lot. Yeah, Godfrey kind of sucks. Uh, as harsh as it may be. Oh no, he has two. He's not as bad. But he's still a shield hammer, so he sucks. Uh, he also has Light of Justice, restores 0.6% HP every second. Yeah. Godfrey's a... Uh... He's a he he's a blade. I'll just say that. He exists. Is he good? No. Is it night time already? Please consider taking a rest. Hello. Soon we'll be big somebody talking, yes? Friend know anything about suspicious things happening there? There was one request I thought was decidedly suspicious. We got an open fellow asking about supplies of poisonous substances. I told him we do not handle such items here, of course, and he left soon after. But from what I hear, he's been asking around other places, too. Who knows what he might be plotting? Much thanks. So he asked for poison, huh? Uh, I got a new side quest, I think. Or not a new side quest, but a new... Merc Michon. You have cookies. Hello. Well, um, I saw these weird bird people. Not like Napa, a bit bigger than that, and really, um, birdie looking. I think I saw pictures of them before in a picture book, but I can't really remember what they're called. Turkin, maybe? That's it, they're called Turkin. Thanks, that was really bugging me. But what would a bunch of Turkin be doing in a place like this? Very interesting that you mention that. 
Hello. Have you heard about the about anything untoward during, going on in the Orion Ardanian summit? I do wonder. Myself, I am an Ardanian, yet I live under the protection of Indol. And the Orions and Gormati here, for instance, seem to get along just fine, just as well. But just take a look at those lot, clutching their tools of conflict, fixing one another with the coldest of stairs. They can't even have a civil discussion short of holding a banquet like this. Don't you think it's absurd? If they have the time to be wasting on such extravagancies, they should use it to save their own suffering people. As I adjust my hair. It does, it does frustrate me. Sometimes I think people, these people running those nations could learn a thing or two from our camp. Ellipses. Yeah, same here. War is kind of overrated. Hello. You have a you have a funny hat. Hey, have you heard anything about the suspicious going down at Ryan Journey Summit? Oh, I have a good one for you. Some kind of ingredients for the monsters the foul odor were carried into the Ardanian Titan vessel. The stench was so strong I can still smell it on my clothes. There were other ingredients too, weird and wonderful, a lot of them. I don't know what they're for, but I can't be your average recipes. Hmm, he thinks they'd be trying to poison. They'd be trying to poison, that's what I think. These are uh, weird, suspicious food items. Hello. Perhaps there's untoward intentions in the more at inside. Frankly, I'd expect it. But I can assure you that we of Rai have no intentions of trying anything funny. The word of Queen Wakura is absolute. We trust in our queen and she wills it. We gladly play, put our weapons aside. So there's no need for concern. Of course, if the queen ordered me to take up arms, I would gladly fight tooth and nail against those Ardenian dogs. You would do well not to forget that. Uh, right. He had nothing interesting to say, I guess. And we're you. Let us go. Uh oh hey. There's a Gullumd. Hello. Know anything about a black market merchant who's been up to no good here in Indol? Problems at the summit are a ridiculous notion. The summit will be held aboard this Titan battleship, so we have no need to fear attacks from the outside. This door is the only entrance, and it will not, not be opened until just before the summit to admit Queen Rakura. We've not allowed a single suspicious individual to pass this point. As such, there's no need to fear attack from within, either. I mean, you say that, but... What if somebody was using a disguise? Who knows what kind of disguise? Let us go. Not me, that's for sure. Hello. What say you? Certainly something going on, not quite right going on. I saw a very large wooden box being transported in the Titan battleship. It was accounted for on the inventory list, so most of my colleagues think it's no problem. But I honestly can't imagine what they would want such a huge box for. I'm worried about what might be inside. Might be inside the box. Hmm? Hello. I'm going to... Okay, never mind. The Ardanian title ba Titan Battleship is extremely sturdy defenses. I doubt there's a single weapon in this whole port that could damage it. Besides, I hear the main conference will only be intended by a very select tr group of trustworthy individuals. Well, I can't imagine how many miscreant... How any miscreant could hope to get close to the VIPs to harm them, even if they wanted to. A lot of people here are on edge, but I don't think there's anything to worry about. Yeah, well, even so. Hello. Nothing on toward is going on in our Indian army, I assure you. Those who have come to Indol belong to the Karag Imperial Guard. The elite soldiers who have sworn solemn myths to protect the Emperor. So if anything suspicious were going on, I'd venture you'd have to be on the Orion side. I find it difficult to tell what those people are thinking sometimes. The Ardanians are suspicious of the Orions, and the Orions are suspicious of the Ardanians. Wow. 
Hello. In the current climate, I fear almost anything could happen. I can scarcely wait for the day when that huge, awful Titan battleship is gone from our shores. It pains me to see such an unsightly structure in our beautiful city. I'm sure all the upstanding Indoline citizens recent resent its presence. Why can Moradain and Uriah not cease all this foolish conflict and simply submit themselves to the will of Indol? Uh, I'm sure there's many reasons, actually, but... Mainly because you said the word submit, and that's not really something I would like to do if I was a big nation.